What up, good people? Today is Team Minute Tip Tuesday. Let's get into this video. Today we're going to talk about what is hydroplane. Hydroplane is where you lose control of your vehicle in the rain. Yes. So that's what hydroplaning is. Hydroplaning is dangerous and it's serious because of the fact that you can lose your life or you can damage your vehicle or you can damage somebody else's vehicle and kill somebody else. Not kind of dangerous, it is dangerous. So yeah. So how do hydroplane work? Hydroplane works as in if you got ball tires, so it can happen with ball tires and um, tires with good tread, but we're gonna talk about ones with ball tires. Ball tires is you're driving over three to four inches of water. Yeah, you're probably saying, well, I'm not driving over three or four inches of water. When it's raining really hard, you don't know if you're driving over three or four inches of water because it's very, you know, like, so you're driving over three or four inches of water with bald tires and the tires does not have no way of channeling the water out somewhere. So now you're driving on top of the water. Since you're driving on top of the water, how can you get traction? You cannot get traction driving on top of the water because you do not have traction on a pavement so it's like the water and the pavement so you're this is the pavement this is the water and then this is you you're driving on top of the water so you know it's kind of crazy so yes that's what ball tires do it let you drive on top of the water and you losing uh traction of your vehicle so you probably like oh well i'm not driving on top of the water yes sometimes it channel away but Sometimes, if you're driving really fast, you're driving on top of the water and you're losing traction of your vehicle. We're gonna talk about tires with good tread. How can you, so you're like, Artist Speed, how can I um, hydroplane with a uh, tire with good tread? That's a good question. Because of the fact that, um, yes, the water can channel now, but you're creating a ripple effect. So what happened, you're creating that ripple effect and your tires wind up hopping on top of the water. So, now you're driving on top of the water again, and you're losing control of your vehicle. And you're looking like, oh man, I lost control of my vehicle. That is hydroplaning. How can you prevent hydroplaning? Is once you feel that you're about to hydroplane, lightly, gently, uh, press the brake and turn the steering wheel left or right, whatever way that you wanna go. If you wanna go left, turn it left. If you wanna go right, turn it right. And once you get back on the uh, pavement, you good. When you're driving in, uh, in rainy conditions, this is just a good um, tip. When you're driving in rainy condition, lower your speed. You got people who drive really fast when they're in the rain, it's like, bro, why are you driving so fast in the rain? You know what I'm saying? So lower your speed and slow down as you start approaching water. You know what I'm saying? If you know it's going to be, you see the person ahead of you splashing water, slow your car down and, yeah, splash water, but slow your car down. Because that's because they splash water. You may not splash water. You may drive on top of the water. So that's not good. But if you're enjoying this video, go to smash that thumbs up button. If you're not part of our speed family, go ahead and subscribe button. Yo, welcome to the family. I look forward to seeing you next video.